look at it, ladies and gentlemen. It's Pakistan Tour of Australia Test Series Game 1. You know, that means it means only one thing, and that is that I get to make my test debut right here, right now. You know what it also means? I get to make my test debut. The same time Manus Labuskakhni makes his test debut in real life. It is meant to be, ladies and gentlemen. It is meant to be. Second thing, these bloody uncultured swines, these commentators I'm talking about, they need to get their shit together. They keep calling him Manus Labuschagne. And fair enough, that's the Australian pronunciation. But he's not Australian. He's, well, I guess he's Australian now. But he was born a South African. All right? Say it the way it is meant to be. He's got a gorgeous, beautiful name. Don't ruin it. All right? Every time they say Labuschagne, I want to punch him in their throat. All right, I don't actually, but you know what I mean. It pisses me off. He's got a gorgeous name. Please respect the name. Anyways, third thing I want to say is that uh, it's news from Kookaburra. It's good and bad. Good in the sense that they, you know, congratulated me on my test debut. They were going to send me a new bat, the ghost bat that I really like. I asked them for it, and they were like, you know what? We'll send you a new bat. You're making your debut. It's going to be amazing. Oh, look at that. Bob Razum is our captain. I, I, I thought it would be Mohamed Amr, but it's Bob Razum. So we've got three different captains for our three different, you know, formats. Anyways, I'm getting sidetracked. <laughs> so they're like, we're going to send you your bat. And they send the bat. But the bat is not here. So I call the shipping guy. I'm like, where's my bat? He says, oh, I'm sorry, mate. I lost your bat. And I'm like, oh, did you really lose the bat? Or is it in your ba backyard? You know, you stole it. And I'm pretty sure he stole it, but he said he lost it. And I contacted uh, Kookaburra, I told him, and they were like, yeah, that guy's a prick. He's stolen Labuskakhni's bat, too, when we send him uh, for his debut. And um, apparently whenever we send out new bats, he just loses them. Look at that. We ch uh, won the toss and chose to bat first. But like I was saying, they told me the guy's a prick. You know, he lo steals bats all the time. I don't know why we keep sending bats to that guy. But, uh, but uh, you know, they do, and so it makes no sense. But... That, it is what it is. I, I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna uh, tell them how to conduct their business. I mean, I should probably, because they're not doing a very good job. But the point is, they've sent a replacement bat. Hopefully, he won't steal that one, because he's already stolen one. So he need, doesn't need two. I mean, come on, he only needs one. Although that bat is sexy AF, and two is always better than one, if you know what I mean. Anyways, so uh, the good news is that I'm gonna have it by the end of this game. The bad new, uh, news is, I won't have it during this game. So uh, there's that, and first ball, a test career. I'm going to play it the way it should be played. That's right, solid block. That's how you should start your test career. And I, I wish Manus Labuskakhni was playing here as well. He's not. He is playing in real life, though. Oh, also, uh, in real life, the game is going really well for Pakistan, not so well for Australia. I do not know what's going on with Australia. I mean, you used to be a force to be reckoned with, and I just don't know what's happened. Uh, ever since that Steve Smith and David Warner thing, yep. it's just been downhill for you guys. And there's my first test runs, first of many. Let's hope, oh, it's an overthrow. No, 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 no. Let's keep it calm. Let's hope it's first of many. It's my first single. Like I was saying, yeah, ever since Steve Smith and Warner is gone, I mean... I don't know, you guys have not been doing too well, and I hope you do, because you are a very... Ooh, he swung that a lot. But yeah, you're a big nation, a great cricketing nation, and uh, it's never nice to see uh, someone go down like that. The same thing is happening with Sri Lanka, a great cricketing nation, but I don't know what's going on with them. They're just losing left and right. Anyways, let's concentrate on this game. And I, uh, um, congratulations to all the Pakistanis because we've pretty much won the game. And, uh, well, I better luck next time to all the Australians watching. And uh, amazing yep. debut by Bilal Asif, by the way. Six wickets on his debut. What a bloody lad he's turning out to be. Hope he continues that form. You know what? Let's go straight down the ground, Saki boy. Let's take him on. And I think that's going to... Holy shit, how big is this ground, dude? That's the three ideals, and it didn't go to the boundary for four runs. Wow, this it's the SC, S, uh, what am I saying? Sydney Crooked Ground, SCG, that's it. <laughs> I forgot the, oh, whatever, mate. But how, that's, how big is this? Should have gone to the boundary, it was ideal. Yeah. Timing ideal, footwork no. ideal, shot choice, no! Okay, we're good. Joshua, let's go straight down the ground and that's gone. I'm not even gonna run. I'm confident that one's gone. Yes, it is, all right. That one is finally, 
finally, it's the first boundary of my test career, so there you have it. And uh, it would have made me look like a right cunt if that had not gone to the boundary for four. And well, let's go straight down the ground, and there you go, I'm finding my bearings now. I'm really getting into it now, I'm, I'm starting to middle the ball. You know, it wasn't too easy at the beginning, this is only my second boundary of the innings, and I've been out there for quite some time. You know what, I'm gonna go over the top. Nathan Loyne, oh, have I hit it well? Have I hit it well? I have hit it well. It's the three ideals again, and it's not gone for six. This stadium is huge, mate. Th th that's a six in any other stadium, but this one, I don't know how big this is. But it is huge, I don't know. Maybe it's not, maybe it's something that, uh, the game is messing up or something, I don't know. You know what, I'm gonna go straight down the ground. Have I hit that well? Nope, I haven't, it's not gonna go. For a six. Holy shit. Oh, okay, good. I thought it wasn't even going to go for a four. I'm like, what is happening? I know this stadium is big, but how big is it? It's not even going to go for a four. I don't know if I've mentioned it or not, but we've lost how much is that. And the reason why I'm, I'm sort of picking up the pace a bit more now is because my guy is at like the red confidence level thing. You know, like how Wahid has this red line under the rim and like Cummings has it too. Oh, look at that. 50 partnership. Yeah, my guy has it too, so I'm trying to change it from... Oh, it's gone to green now. That's perfect. All right, there we go. So, yeah, that's what I was trying to do. I was trying to make it green, which means, like, good, you're in good form or good high confidence or some, some bullshit like that. I don't know. It affects your gameplay, so that's all that matters. It's been pissing me off. I've been trying to play the straight drive. Oh, finally get it away. And is that going to go all the way? Oh, I think it's going to go all the way. That's my 50. Let's go. 50 on debut. So I've been trying to play that straight drive to get a four or just a couple of runs so I can get my 50. But uh, Nathan lawn has been stopping it. <laughs> uh, yeah, as you can see, it's just dots after dots after dots. Finally get the boundary and my 50. And look at that, I'm pr playing like a normal human being. 75 or 76 deliveries. You know what, let's go again. Whoa, I've beaten them again. Wait, that's not enough though. It's not enough, yeah. Wait, is it? Nope, it's not. He's just gonna take two. Oh, let's go. Oh, I think I nicked that one a bit. But it doesn't matter because it's gone to the boundary for four. And that is all that matters. When you find the gap and the ball reaches the boundary in no time. Well, let's go straight down the ground. Oh, come on, why can't I hit a six? I just want one six. I want to hit at least one six on my debut. Come on. If I'm meant to be the next boom boom, I have to hit at least one six. That's the bar, the minimum, you know? You know what? Let's go straight. Oh, I've beaten them. Yeah, that's gone. That's another bar. That's a very expensive over. Three fours and a single. And we've lost Wahid as well. I missed it. Did he get a 50? I'm not too sure. But he was on 48 last time I... I well, last time I remember. I'm pretty sure I've seen him after that, but I don't remember him. Right there. Oh, yeah, he did get 50. I see it on the scorecard over there. That session's ended. We've done pretty well, I'd say. We've lost two wickets. Right, two. Or three. No, two, yeah. So look at that. Shazad got 11. Uh, well, he'd got exactly 50 or 51. And Saad now is doing pretty well as well. 25 or 21. Um, one thing I'd like these batsmen to do is to calm down a bit. They're playing like me in T20. Do you know what I mean? Uh, that doesn't end well, we've seen. Uh, it could, but do it doesn't always end well. Um, so, this is a test game, so let's calm it down. I mean, if me, the next boom boom, is calming myself down, then you have no right to go after the ball as like that, all right? Ooh, that's a short one. Let's pull it away first. Pull shot of the get of the day. Oh, look at that. He's dragged it with him. Over the rope. And that's four runs. I was expecting maybe a couple of runs. Oh, that's a 100 partnership of 112 deliveries. And uh, 96 I'm off. So if I hit another four. Oh, shit. I just realized. If I had another four. No. If I had another... <laughs> If I hit another four, that's going to be a hundred on my debut. I, f I completely forgot this was my debut. What is wrong with me? On 99, on debut, let's play the leg glance. I haven't played it too well, but it's enough for me to get the single, which means I get the hundred. The debut hundred. Look at that. Raise that bat. 
Because you deserve it, mate. You deserve... Actually, you deserve that new bat that you were meant to get, but you anyways, let's move past it. It's whatever, mate. It's in the past. It's like the underwater bridge. What is that saying? But water under the water under a bridge. That's it. Not underwater bridge. What am I saying, mate? Anyways, try to play another pull shot. Didn't work out that well. We could get a second, but I'm not gonna risk it because it's a test game. Let's take our time, yeah. You know what? Let me smack it. Sm oh, straight down the ground. Almost said smate down the ground. I'm like, what? And that's a four. If I can get 150 on my debut now, that would be extra special, won't it? But yeah, you know what? Uh, um, where is he gonna bowl? I wanna go over the top. You know what? Let's just. Oh no! Oh no! Come on! What a. Uh, what a stupid way to get out. 113 of 154 deliveries. 11 fours, no sixes, but we've still got the second innings though. I might hit a six in that one. I'm hoping to hit at least one. Uh, David Warner takes the catch. Why did I do that? I mean, I I know why. I, I wanted to hit at least one six. That's really why, but come on. Anyways, so my innings, my debut innings have come to an end. It was a good one. I got a hundred. And Bob Razum, the skipper, is now out there in the middle, and let's see what he can do. Let's see what... Oh, we're in a very good position. We've gone over... Oh, my God, Mohamed Saad's doing great. I don't know if it's Mohamed Saad's M Saad, so I'm assuming it's Mohamed. But, yeah, we, he's, he, he scored 150, or over 150, so... It's brilliant. No stats yet for me, as this is my debut. But, yeah, we scored a little over 400 runs, so... Uh, it's great. It's just like real life. We got a great start, and we took a wicket so, uh, so, so early. So, it's turning out to be just like real life. Can I get a maiden? Nope, I cannot. They will take a single. So that's just uh, just one run off my first over ever in international cricket, international test cricket, I should say. You know what? Let's bring it inside. Oh, that's gone. That's surely. Yo, raise that finger, mate. Whoa, why didn't he... I'm going to challenge that. You know what, we've got two two reviews. I'm going to challenge that. Let's do that. It's probably bat involved. Why did I do that? Come on, man. <laughs> yeah, it's probably bat. Because it looked pretty straight. Yep, there's some bat. There's some bat involved. Yeah, right there. Wait, actually. Hold on. Oh, see the the... What is this called? I forgot what this is called. But they fixed it. Remember last time we couldn't see anything? Let's see. Yep. <laughs> Definitely, there's a thick edge. Oh, pretty, pretty uh, well so far. I mean, test you need wicket. Oh, we got Bancroft. But they're going pretty well too. I thought we got the early wicket, but we couldn't. Uh, yeah, we couldn't keep dominating. Because they've made a good comeback. Now well, let's go with an in-swing and Yorker, let's go mate! That is what I'm talking about. I think I've smashed his middle stump out. It's the skipper, Steve Smith. Gun ski mate, 28 runs he scored. Look at that, yep, got his middle stump. That's definitely gonna be my thumbnail. Get in mate. His new balanced back couldn't do anything about that. Anyways, look at that. Got the one with the camera. The pole with the camera. I aimed for the leg stump. It swung so much, it smashed the middle one instead. Peter Hanscom is out there now. And uh, we know he can bat a bit. And I was going to get the thumbnail here. But sometimes this game has this glitch where if you try to get the thumbnail with the screenshot right after... Uh, You've just gotten the wicket, it'll like freeze and you know, you lose the wicket. It's happened to me multiple times, uh, so that's why I waited a delivery to get the screenshot. Let's skip this, see... Oh, they're batting quite well. Oh, actually, no, they're not batting well at all. 270 all gone, and they didn't give me the ball after that. But I did manage to get one wicket, my debut, my maiden wicket, my first ever wicket, and look at that, I've gotten... A maiden 100 as well on my debut. If I can get another 100 here, that would be fantastic. Won't it? 
That would be just amazing. Ooh, first delivery. And I'm off the mark. That is how we do it, mate. Just go in the square area. There's a fielder there, but I think I've beaten him. That's a lovely leg glance using the pace of Saki Boy. Although that was a slower delivery than his normal ones. He's gone for four. Oh, I've pissed him off. He's come back with a short one. And I've got a top hedge. There's a fielder there, but I think I'm going to beat him. Yes, I have. Oh, have I? Wait. Oh, yes, I have. All right. We got to it after it had already crossed the boundary, which means I got four runs, but that was a thick top edge. You know what? Let's just go on the off. Oh, no. Whoa. Come on. I'm gone. Just 13 runs this time. One slip field that dropped me. The other one caught me. I thought I was safe because one of... Oh, man. It dropped me. The first one dropped me, and Starkey Ball was there to lash onto it. He was mad from the beating I gave him in the last, so he was like, you are not dropping this one, mate. We are going to make sure. Look, right here. The first fielder drops it, and Saki Boy is like, nope, line. Yeah, Nathan Line drops it, and Saki Boy is like, nope, not today, little boy. Anyways, uh, so I'm going just 17, uh, what was it? 17 or 13? I think it was 13. No more were he oh, wow. Oh, no, this is not looking good. No, please, come on. All right, all right, we've done, we've done well enough. But now they're not losing any wickets. It's still none for 99. Wow. It's Warner and who? David Warner and the other guy. The guy's name. Hanscom? No, not Hanscom. Uh, Bancroft. Yeah, that's all. Yep, it is Bancroft. So Bancroft's got his 50. Uh, Warner hasn't yet. He's eight runs away. We have to break this partnership. They're making a very strong comeback. This is very unlike real... Well, it could be like real life, because I don't know. We haven't played the fifth day yet. They might make a comeback in real life if they do. I mean, to be honest, if there is someone who can climb the huge mountain of runs that we have put in front of, it's Australia, of all teams, you know. Um, so I'm not like... I'm not, you know... I'm not just going to say that we've won... <laughs> before we've won even though I've already said we've won I might have jinxed it I shouldn't have said that uh, but uh, I guess we'll find out tomorrow won't we or today because you're watching tomorrow because I anyways it, it makes sense to me no, it won't make sense to you but because I recorded this yesterday which is today for me because I'm recording it today but you know what I mean come on man alright oh I think I've balled a no ball yep I've balled a no ball why, why is everybody clapping? Did I ball the no ball? Oh, it's because it's the 100 partnership cup. Like what? A no ball is not something you celebrate. Well, I guess you do if you're the opposition. It's going to be a maiden. Waiting. Yep, it is a maiden. Let's ball two maidens in a row, shall we? Wait there. Yes, we can. It's another maiden. Oh, they've taken me off. Wow, they're... This opening partnership is ruining us. 76 from Warner, 101 from Bancroft. Amazing partnership, mate. Oh! Oh! It didn't swing back. Just... Should have... No, it didn't swing back as much as I wanted it to. Could have been our first breakthrough. Look at that. They're in a very good position. 462. I know it's a big total, but they are in a great position to win it. Wait. Come on, let's ball a maiden. It's not swinging. It's literally not swinging. It's the complete opposite of the first innings. I was swinging a lot in the first innings. All right, that's another maiden. They're gonna. <gasps> Yo, how's he? How's he? How's he? How's he? How's he? How's he? Come on. Shit, I don't know if I should review this or not. Oh, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. Okay, I'm not gonna. I think it was drifting down the leg stump. It definitely didn't hit the bat in this occasion, but I think it was a bit wide. But I'm definitely going to check the... Yeah, the big guy. Oh, I see. Yeah. Yep. It was too wide. And that's another maiden. Come on, man. At least hit me for a boundary so I have some highlights. Oh, look, they're finally going to score a run. Yay. And it's 200 up as well. So there you go. I finally got a highlight, a proper highlight to show you. <laughs> 200 partnership. Wow. 200 opening partnership. It's 254. 
Okay, now I pretty much want it at this point. Why? Imagine if they come out tomorrow and do this to us. Oh boy. It's going to be one heck of a comeback if they actually pull it off. I hope they don't because I'm obviously supporting Pakistan. But if they do, then, uh, well, congratulations, Australia, I guess. <laughs> wow, I, I really hope they don't do this to us tomorrow. I really hope Muhammad Abbas and Bilal Asif can do the same thing that in the last innings. All right, that's another one. Or is that a boundary? I think that's a boundary. Or, oh, yep, it is a boundary. Bancroft plays that ever so nicely, so gracefully. It's so effortless, you know, just put his bat in front of the ball and it's gone. To the boundary for four. They've taken me off again. Have they brought me back on? Yes, they have. Still, they haven't lost a wicket. Come on, man. Come on. Ooh, whoa. See, it didn't swing again. It was supposed to come back. Should I review this one? I'm not gonna, because the thing is, it's just not swinging. I'm gonna look at the big ant, though, not replay. Where is it? There it is. Yeah, you see, there's no movement. Yeah, look, there's literally no movement. Wait. I guess this would have been a maiden if I hadn't balled a no ball. But, uh, yeah, one run off this one. Warner still hasn't gotten his hundred. What is he doing, mate? That's very unlike Warner. Finally, a single. You can stop it. All right. So that's one run off the sofa so far. One delivery soul to go. Oh, look at that! We finally got Warner. He got to, he got his hundred though. Finally got a wicket. He broke that partnership up. And uh, yeah, they've pretty much won this game because now Fajer is out there. He can. He's again a very good batsman. So Bancroft is still out there. He's in top form. Obviously, he scored a hundred. So, uh, ball is not moving at all. See, that was supposed to come back inside, but it's just a straight, like a standard delivery. But, uh, yeah. Unless we pull off a miracle, they need just 200 more runs with nine wickets. That's it's quite easy to get for a side like Australia. Been bowling lots of no ball. <gasps> come on, it's not going to be out. It was too wide and it didn't come back. It was supposed to swing back and it... Ah, come on. What do I have to do to get it? Look at that. It's just a straight delivery. It's actually swung inside. It was supposed to come back in, man. Let's go with another Yorker. Oh, let's go. The in-swing in Yorker has really been working for me. Hanscom has gone just full runs. Yes, mate. Finally, I get a wicket. And the ball is finally moving a bit. We're getting a bit of a reverse swing in the air, you know. Well, that's good to see. Let's go. Smashed another stump out. Got my second wicket of my test debut. Uh, test debut? Test career <laughs> is what I meant to say. <laughs> on my test debut is what I meant to say. And it's Marcus Harris who's coming on. And uh, yeah, it's pretty good. Nearly 60 average. We've gotten four wickets. But the thing is they need like 120 more runs to win. With six wickets in hand. Which is... Uh, you know, very easy to do for a side like Australia. And look at Bancroft. He's still out there, 192. He might even get a double hundred. And, well, I was going to say it's a maiden, but I bowled a no ball. I'm pretty sure Bancroft is going to get 200 and he's going to get the... Uh... Oh, excuse me. He's going to get... Oh, why? That was a big yawn. Yep, they've won the game. Oh my god. So Australia have won by four wickets. I hope this doesn't happen in real life. That is horrendous. Cameron Bancroft, yep, he got the man of the matches. He got a 50 in the first one and 265 in the second innings. So that's how it all started. We came out of bat first. Shows I've got 11. I got 113 on my debut. 50 for Wahid. 166 for Saad. 13 for Razum, uh, 18 for Sadiq, none for Hassan, 5 for Bhatti, uh, Shadab Khan with 16, 9 for Yasser Shah, Hassan Ali with 4, scoring 408 runs total in 93.2 overs. We definitely took our time with that one. But uh, yeah, looked like a pretty good total uh, in the first innings, especially after they came out and 
did, uh, oh yeah, their balling figures, sorry, I was going to go straight into their batting figures, but three for Hazelwood, two for Lyon, and three for Cummins, and Starkey Boy surprisingly did not get any wickets at all, um, so those are the bowling figures, but yeah, they came out and seven runs for Warner, 57 for Bancroft, 66 for Khwaja, 28 for Smith, 29 for Hanscom, 39 for Harris, Payne got eight, three for Cummins, eight for Stark, 17 for Lyon, Hazelwood with seven, 270 total. So yeah, after that, it looked like a very good uh, position we were in. Uh, but the only thing that happened, just like in real life, actually, you know, after the first innings, we looked in real good position. And uh, yeah, then we came out to bat. Why isn't it changing? Oh, there we go. Oh, again, I have to do the wickets first. <laughs> I always forget about the bowlers. So yeah, none for Hassan Ali, one for Bhatti, one for myself, four for Shadab Khan, and three for Yasser Shah. So the, the wrist spinner is doing the trick there. Three for one for Shadab Khan, the youngster, and I mean four for uh, the youngster, and three for Yasser Shah, the experienced bowler. 270 all out and 67 some overs, and then we came out, put up quite a fight actually, to be honest. 12 for Shahzad, 13 for me. 30 for Wahid, 93 for Saad, 6 for Azamar, is that 5? 94 for Sadiq, 13 for Hassan, 46 for Bhatti, 15 for Shadab Khan, 1 for Yasser Shah, and 1 for Hassan Ali, scoring 323 in the second in innings. That's pretty good total. And at this point, we were thinking, you know, we've got this. We're, we're doing all right. I and mean, we would have liked to put, you know, 100 more runs on there. But, um, yeah, it's pretty okay so far. Uh, pretty much like real life, actually, we're 100 runs short than real life now that I think about it. But, uh, yeah, I certainly thought we were in a very good position. And then this, again with the bowlers, come on, I keep forgetting them. Alright, so Hazelwood got four wickets. Starkey Boy got three in this one, he didn't get any in the last one, he made up for it in this one. Cummins got one in line, got one as well. Restricting us to 323 in 72 <laughs> overs and yeah Hazelwood is a pick of the ball is there Starkey boy was so the pace is doing the trick here um, yeah uh, and then they came out and oh my god David Warner and Cameron ba Bancroft just took the game away from us 113 for Warner 267 for Bancroft 25 for Waja 6 for Smith 4 for Hanscom 16 for Harris 21 for Payne 2 for Cummins and just like that they won the game scoring two, uh, 462 with a loss of 6 wickets and 92 overs yep needless to say our balling figures won 2 great Hassan Ali with 2 wickets uh, but he with 1 gave up 83 runs 84 runs given by Yasser Shah in 17 no wickets Shadab Khan took 2 wickets 27 overs 166 is what he gave up. I only bowled 15, only I say. I bowled 15. Uh, six of them were maidens. Got one wicket and gave up 14 runs only. And uh, But it wasn't enough for us to win the game. We were um, short by four wickets. As you can see, Australia won by four wickets. And the man of the match goes to very much deservedly Cameron Bancroft with his double ton. And also half century in the first innings. All right, so there's the new bat I was talking about, and that is the bat I'll be using in the next episode, in the next game, game two of this test series. Let's hope it brings me good luck, and I score a double hundred. Just make it even better in my second game, uh, my only my second game in test cricket. But um. Yeah, I'm not going to be participating in the BBL, unfortunately, because I will be playing international cricket, test cricket. There you go, game two against Australia. Which is very weird, because the BBL is going on at the same time Australia is playing. I don't think that will ever happen in real life. But, it is in the game. And as always, if you like this video, smash that like button. And then attack, subscribe, comment, share, do whatever you want to do. And I'll see you in the next video. Until then, have a nice... Oh,